Good morning ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my Singing Anglais channel. My name is Oleg, I'm a fishing guide and expert living now in Prague, Czech Republic and today I'm going to fish together with my friend for the largest fish here living in Czech Republic, catfish wells. And we're going to use this clonk. So let's start. There are a few different types of klong and uh, those with large head they create a like, deep sound and with small head then quite light sound for shallow water uh, but anyway I will try all of them because I don't know which one is going to work I have some of my favorite klongs and uh, and I hope one of them will attract our target catfish. <laughs> How many words do you use? Dozen. Two big hooks and wow. Блин, с змейки поганой запутали. Блин, закрутились. Закрутили все мне. It's for a big fish, definitely. Now it's quiet on the water. Great. All right, let's start. So guys, we have now a clonk battle. Which sound is better? This is a metal clonk. You see? So try. Nice, nice, I like it. And now my wooden old clonk. So which one is better? So the fishing gear I'm going to use today is quite rough. This is an old pen reel jig master for really big fish. Uh, 80 pounds braided line and uh, rod black ball from Cormorant, three meters long or 10 feet, 10 feet long uh, for big lures. As a lure I will use this hook connected to this uh, lead weight and I will put on the hook maybe 10 worms, same as my friend. And this is nice attractant, look at that, dancing skirt. <laughs> should work well. Oh. Uh -huh. oh. Ah. Yes. yes. Мелкий, совсем мелкий. То, что я тебе говорил. <laughs> <laughs> a very little catfish. Look at that. All right. That's one hook and a second hook. It is. Little catfish. Bye. See you. Bye. <laughs> There are a few options how to recognize a bite. First, observe the rod tip, tip and sometimes it's just like that and sometimes it's just BOOM! <laughs> Depends on uh, their mood, not only uh, on uh, size. And the second way, maybe even better, 
is uh, holding the line here or just like that you'll recognize in this way more bites like more weak bites So because we are now stocked in a log chamber waiting for a bigger boat, I want to share with you a few thoughts. First, today's very hot weather, over 30 degrees Celsius, uh, really, really hot, but the water is still cold, perhaps uh, 16, 17 degrees Celsius. It's uh, not enough for a catfish to bite aggressively, especially uh, for um, when a fish is clunk. So that's why we have many bites, but uh, generally quite weak, weak bites and the cat, all catfish are quite small. Uh, another I thought is about the size of a lure. No, my friend fish with worms only and I have like a combination worms and this beautiful skirt. <laughs> but I think it will be, it will target bigger fish at least uh, bigger than one kilo <laughs> or two kilos catfish and then um, also I think that they bite uh, better at this time of the year in August uh, at night but at night uh, it's quite difficult to uh, take a picture or shoot a movie that's why we uh, you know swimming now and we're fishing now uh, during the day it's really hot, but anyway, uh, it's a better idea for now. Uh, may maybe once I will try fishing for a catfish at night, but then, then definitely not today. So we'll uh, keep moving more downstream and I, have, I hope we will catch some bigger exemplars. So here you can easy follow the catfish riding from the bottom. Now there is no fish, but just one minute before one minute before was a nice catfish. Let's follow him, let's follow it. Alright, find more catfish. Not a big one, but decent bite. Nice. Go back and call your father. Okay.
Dear friends, my main goal was to show you fishing with clonk for catfish. It's very interesting fishing method, but also very difficult. So it's influenced, being influenced by many, many factors. Uh, anyway, if uh, there is any professional catfisher from you, please share your thoughts about uh, fishing with clonk. I will much appreciate. And see you in the next video. God bless you and tattoo lines. Bye.